with uh, one of our throwing programs, what we want the player to do, especially in, a, in early stages, is we want him to make a circle and get a good angle and a good arm slot down to the ball. So in order to correct the tendency to go around, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to create an easy straight line. Just to clarify, I'm not saying that side arm is wrong, I'm not saying that three quarters is wrong, but as the, as the player develops, what we want is to add some of these tools, especially the side arm. What we want in the beginning is, is straight lines to, uh, to whatever our target is. Just the easiest way for the player to learn. It's, it's tough to learn. It's not natural in the long run and in general. It is the first tool. Now what we're going to do here, very simple drill where we're going to have the player throw on purpose into the ground and bounce the ball back from a wall. If he does this correctly, the ball will come straight back to him. If he goes around, then the ball will go off. All right, I'm going to demonstrate it before I have my youth player doing, uh, doing this. So basically, if I throw, now watch what I'm going to do. I'm not, I'm not going to throw into the wall. It's okay, it's another drill. What I'm going to do is I'm going to throw down. Now you see what happened. If I do this correctly, and usually we can use a, we can use a tennis ball or a lacrosse ball, the ball, see what happens? My friend uh, Chris here is going to demonstrate this. Chris, to be honest with you, has had this problem where he wasn't in a good position here. His hand was angled. He didn't come off. We want him to get good lines through the ball. So we're going to have him do it first off with a baseball, and then we'll show you a little. I'll, I'll demonstrate, and he'll demonstrate with a lacrosse ball how it even speeds up. It's more exaggerated. actually in a parking lot. You have to watch the surfaces here. Now again, down into the wall, it comes back relatively straight. Again, we're dealing with, with some imperfect surfaces here, but if you have a decent surface, got some brick here that's causing it to bounce a little correctly, but if you have a straight wall, uh, like at a tennis court or something like this, see how the ball will come straight back to me. If I get a straight line here, the ball comes straight back. Straight line, a right angle, throw the ball down. If you do it correctly, the ball comes straight back. If you go around, the ball will anger off. We'll, we're impaired a little bit here by some of the lines, but the drill is, is the correct thing to do. Line up square, throw the ball down, it'll bounce back straight if you do it correctly.